Last Friday, as I was looking around for new music, I came across Pierre Bourne's mixtape The Life of Pierre 4, and I was actually pretty impressed by it, considering the other music I heard I wasn't that impressed by, so today we're going to be making a beat in his style of the mixtape, let's get into it. The first thing I did was take this lead pad sound from my electro bank, which is in the description, you can go get that. And I made this pattern, so at first it's not that good of a pattern in my opinion. So then I'm using another pad for the chords, also from my electro bank, so yeah, these sounds are really Get towards this Pierre Bourne type of Jimmy sound, and yeah, this is the pattern I made with it. Here, I'm just taking out a few notes out of this lead pattern just to make it a little bit more catchy. The less notes, the easier it is to like remember, and easier it is to like hum to. As you can see here, I came in with this bell type of melody, kind of like a pluck. It's a really dreamy type of sound. This one was made based off that Kid Cudi song. And I put it in my electro bank. So you can get this kind of sounds. And I just made a simple like counter melody, but this is the really catchy part of the beat. You'll notice later on in the beat. And one last modification for bouncing set audio is just pitching this down or transposing them down. And here it is the final melody. So when I bounce the set to audio, I mix them out and added some effects. I sped them up to 150 BPM, giving it like a really nice vibe. This is like the perfect tempo for these kind of beats. Then I added this bass 808, which is uh, the modified Z808. So that's the start of it. At the ending, I put like a stutter, just like a Kid Cudi song, which makes it so catchy. One thing I notice as I'm struggling right here with this hi-hat pattern is that the hi-hats that he makes or I should say puts in his songs or in his production are really simple like not like Wheezy or Turbo with those third note rolls it's basically quarter notes and puts one stir that always comes to the same spot every bar finally decide to put this bass in the right octave I don't know why I did the whole cook up without bringing it down but that's pretty much the beat right there sounding real catchy and dreamy final thoughts really like this mixtape from Pierre unexpected he has really good wordplay it's unexpected for his kind of rapping but that's pretty good 
as always i'd really appreciate it if you could like comment share with other producers slash friends just subscribe to the channel for new content every single day but that's it see you next time